Namaste, beautiful soul. Thank you so much for tuning in. My name is Jakara, your favorite SRT practitioner, and you are watching the Blooming Lotus Healing Channel. So today I am going to talk to you about tips uh, in regards to your session after your session, right? So you've done your session, it was amazing, it was all great, and then now it's time to integrate all of this energy, all of this new energy, um, or lack or thereof of negative energies in your in your experience. So the first thing, uh, going back to meditation. So meditation is going to be a key tool for you to really integrate all of the energies, to get to know your new energies better, to get to know your your energy field and your vessel uh, even more, and um, and and feel right, feel into that into that difference that you that you've experienced. So the second thing that I would say is to make sure you hydrate yourself, um, even during the session as well. Uh, and after the session, hydration is important. Make sure that you bless the, the water before you consume it. Uh, that will definitely help you. You can just bless the, wa the water by saying, please, highest self, please spirit, bless this water and take anything from this water that doesn't serve my highest good and please bless it with all the things that serve my highest good. And that's it, and you can just drink the water. The other thing that I would say as well is to take a relaxing bath. That also is really great for you to just really stay and to, it helps you with meditation as well. So that kind of ties up back to meditation is to kind of really get yourself situated in that space of, of, of full self-care and then also um, acknowledgement of the relaxation uh, that, you are, that you are experiencing uh, for your body. So just allowing that to really just release because the, what happens is that we receive healing from the uh, from the spiritual realm, but a lot of it has to still be released through the body. So um, that really does help um, in the process of release. Another thing that does help in the process of release as well, especially from the mental state, is to do journaling. Uh, journal is a really great way for you to uh, just get yourself uh, situated with where you are at right now and um, where you are at at the time of the session or I'm sorry after the session and uh, it helps you also connect more to your highest self connect more to your guides and uh, and again it helps release anything that doesn't serve uh, into the paper and out of your mind um, and, uh, and it's also a, a, an active way for you to be part of a participant of that, of, um, of that healing, right? Uh, by you taking action, that, that's a beautiful active way of being a participant of the healing. Uh, and the last thing that I would mention as well is to go into nature. Nature is a powerful, powerful grounding, um, grounding tool for us. Uh, when we go into nature, into Mama Gaia, and we hug a tree or we put our feet on the ground, um, it really does help ground all of the energies into our bodies, all of the healing into our bodies, and um, and yeah, it's just it's just a really great way to to finish. You know, it's almost like like a like like a, a stamp of approval that we give to that healing um, after the session. So you can do that right after the session, or you can do that a couple of days into the session, but definitely do it. And the closer to the to the time of the session, the better. Um, so that way, you can really get all of the uh, the benefits of all of these activities that I mentioned um, right away. So let me know in the comments if you have any questions or if you have any tips that you've done uh, on your own uh, regarding after you you've been on a SRT uh, healing or any other healing. And I look forward to hear from you. Make sure you subscribe to this channel. And thank you and Namaste.